to Summit Sunrise here with Duncan from Love and Ski Area. And you know, this weekend, as we see, you know, more and more spring breakers heading into town, if you want to beat the crowds, save a little cash, Loveland is definitely a great place to go. And uh, can we just, let's just kick this off with how much your daily lift tickets are for adults, Duncan. Well, up at Loveland, you can get an adult full day ticket for only $59, which is half of what you pay at some of the other Summit County resorts. That is crazy. Like if you, it, yeah, do, do a little shopping, go and see what even like a half day is at some of these other resorts. It doesn't even come close. That's amazing. Exactly. And I'll give you a little secret. You can save a little bit more money by uh, purchasing tickets at some of our offsite vendors. Good partners such as Pioneer Sports over in Frisco and uh, Christie's right here in Dillon. Nice. Yeah. Okay. So lots of money to be saved. Oh yeah. And um, not only can you save money on lift tickets, but we have a great ski and ride school program. It's um, guaranteed to get busy during the spring break holiday and uh, you can save gr save a ton of money and have a great time with Loveland Ski and Ride School. Now that, I, I would have to agree with you on that. I love the way that your ski school is set up. It's, it's like its own entity. You don't have to worry about people, you know, flying by you if you're learning for the very first time, because that can be so intimidating. And I love that you can, you know, it's not a very intimidating, you know, incline and you can see the bottom like right there. Exactly. We have our own separate beginners area that hosts the Ski and Ride School. And it is the, the best place to learn to ski and ride. Like you said, you get out of the, the intimidation of the big mountain, the mm -hmm. fast skiers around you, and yeah, you just have your own learning area, which is um, really helps people pick it up quickly. Yeah, and you know, something that I love too is like, especially if like grandma's coming along and the kids are starting to learn and maybe you have some members of your family that aren't really into skiing or snowboarding or they're, they're just not really into it, but you guys actually have snowshoe trails. Yeah, you know, we actually just started that this year and we do rent snowshoes. It's at the valley only, which is the beginner's area. But um, yeah, if you have a family member who's not quite ready to strap on a board or skis, the snowshoes is a great way to get outside, um, check out the beauty that Colorado has to offer. Oh yeah. And, uh, have fun up at Loveland. Especially right now, because it certainly feels like spring out there and it will all weekend long. So uh, what are you guys doing to kind of celebrate all this fantastic weather and the fact that we're getting into March? Well, other than great skiing, we've got some cool events and live music coming up. Um, this weekend, we have the Goals Vertical Challenge, the Get Outside and Learn Something. It's a uh, vertical challenge, to so you raise pledges to uh, ski as many vertical feet as you can, to raise money for outdoor uh, wilderness river trips to help uh, kids learn some outdoor education and get outside away from those video games and uh, learn a little bit more about the world that surrounds them. Nice. Well, especially in Colorado, that seems like a, a pretty awesome thing to be doing and pretty important. It's you a know. great program. Yeah. yeah. And so um, for people that want to maybe sign up for that, is there still a way to do that or do you just want to come out and support? Or You can come out and support or if you want to um, sign up, visit www.skiloveland.com and check out our event calendar. We have all the details up on there. And um, not only that, but we've got tons of great spring events coming up and live music all listed online, www.skilovelin.com. Nice. Check it out, something fun for everyone. All right, well, make sure you look at that website and of course get out and do a little skiing and riding at Loveland this weekend. Very affordable, so much fun. The terrain is incredible. And uh, have you been out lately? Have you been testing the conditions? I have, a little bit of quality control work. And let me just tell you, it might not be spring yet, but it sure feels like it. Yeah. It is classic Colorado, especially outside today. Not a cloud in the sky, yeah. bluebird, um, warm, and I guess it's supposed to stay that way all weekend. Yeah. So if you want a fantastic, classic Colorado ski weekend, this is the time to do it, and Loveland's the place. I could not agree more. All right, Duncan, well, thank you for coming on this morning. Thank you for having me. And, uh, Anytime, anytime. <laughs> We're going to take another quick break here in Summit Sunrise. More watching when to come, and then we'll be checking in with Ryan, finding out what's going on with our weather and snow reports. So stick around. Lots to do here on your Friday edition.